Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Catherine. The anti-time in eternity. Basically, basically, I thought to myself, why not oh, just, uh, since I tortured my, my fellow commentators with uh, time and eternity, why not commentate with the polar opposite of it? So would it be tortured, scared out of our minds, or entertained? Shiro, if I'm, not if, if, if I'm not mistaken, and both Shiro, if I'm mistaken, Shiro and Jova have no experience with uh, Atlas games, do you guys? But it said Deep no, Silver being lied to us. So. No, 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 so no, 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 Deep Silver published the game in Europe. Because Atlas uh, can't do it themselves. Because because Atlas Europe, the, Atlas still doesn't have an Europe division, so they have well, to. Well, Sega's, Sega's publishing. Um, well, of course, so that's the, well, yeah, the, 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 yeah, of course. Now that Sega owns Open Atlas, the, now that Sega owns Atlas, that's not going to be a problem anymore. But uh, yeah, at this point in time, wow, we're talking positives about Sega. Oh my god! So this is a PS3 game. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. Oh people are falling. People are falling. It's like the happening. Okay, okay, so basically, yeah, uh, get used to this, guys. Atlas's games are full of bizarre symbolism. <laughs> uh, from the beginning. Yes. All right, so... so yes, that's why you should Glitzier, tell playing story. Glitzier actually played Persona 4 Golden, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I have. No, so, well, and this that Glitz has played and, that we and, haven't. That's and, interesting. And, from the beginning. Yeah, and this game is made by the Persona team. Yes, the exact same people that made Persona 4 Golden and also made this game. So I'm sure Dwebs is looking forward to another game by them. Mm -hmm. Well, bear in mind I haven't completed Persona 4 Golden yet. Yeah, but you know it's awesome. So All the world's a stage and all the men and women. Uh, 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 we let's take intelligent stuff and put it in our game. That's not uh, pretentious at all. Uh, this game is actually smart. So, Legion, uh, is that you? <laughs> I like how that out. Godzilla. That one looked like Legion. Wait, guys, guys, Godzilla had more screen time there than he did in the movie recently. <laughs> Hold on, don't worry. Um, this will make free? more sense. Wow. Don't worry, don't worry. This sequence it will make more sense in, a, in just a bit. Nothing like the menu sequence we were just on. <laughs> no, no. I, it... Moses. Thank you, Golden Playhouse, whoever you are. The story of this game, as if you're watching an actual TV show oh. or something like that. And here we are. Oh my god, it's Lot of Heart. Oh. Only without her second <laughs> <with> her hair. <laughs> I mean, I know she had an afro before, but dang, she really let herself go. I know. The hell happened to her hair? And what happened to her headband? They say if you Oh, but it probably couldn't contain that much hair. Great. Yes. Oh my god, you're talking in riddles. No. No, no, no. This actually is relevant to the plot. Don't worry. So it's relevant this, that she. So this story is kind of like The Matrix. No, 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 no. no. This story is going to be more about. Uh, I, mean, I mean, like, you're, you're asleep, and if you die in your sleep, you die in real life. True, but uh, it's, it's, more, it's, it's actually way better written than The Matrix movies, so don't worry about that. Um, I really don't so recall seeing the Matrix oh, movies just, beyond one. So that's our this, this is our main character Vincent Brooks, played by Troy Baker, and this is our uh, and this is one of the this address Catherine, played by Laura Bailey, and uh, <laughs> that face. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, that rocks. So who's this woman played oh, by? Oh my God, that. that Sorry, then she, she's the host of this of the of Golden Playhouse. She's oh. basically the narrator. Okay, I'm just gonna call her Lotta Hart then, because that's really what she looks like. Lotta Hart with a completely different outfit and just yeah. even buzzier hair. She just let herself go a bit. Yeah. In every way. In Alright, plot. Oh, hi Michelle Ruff. <laughs> oh my god, it's a hey, Yeah, but the other Catherine's you know? Yeah, the other Catherine in this game is is voiced by Michelle Ruff, uh, and if, if you don't know, it, um, she's Cream the Rabbit now. She's what now? She, she voices Cream the Rabbit. Wow. This is the actress. So let me get this straight. So basically, we're having Cream and Blaze go edit each and other over a man. And that's <laughs> oh yes, that's right. In fact, yes, this guy's played by Troy Baker. So let's see, Cream and Blaze are fighting for the affection of Espio. 
Meanwhile, in a story um, narrated by a lot of heart from Ace Eternity. Meanwhile, one of Sh one of Shadow's friends, sorry, one of SBO's friends is Shadow. Catherine McBride. Guess what? Catherine Catherine with a K is called Catherine McBride. Get it? Haha. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, so yeah. This game set in Japan. What's with the English it names? Well, they're trying. Actually, uh, even the original characters in the Japanese version actually have these names. So they were trying to go for a more Western feel they, with this game. Are they, American, are they American expatriates or something? Uh, maybe I don't know. And, and the sheep. The sheep. <laughs> you, you'll see why. You'll see why. Oh yeah, and yeah. Once again, just like with Persona, the animation is done by Studio Four, four degrees, degrees Celsius. So. Oh my God, Celsius! It's the opposite of Fahrenheit. Studio Four Degrees has done pretty much all, mo all of the animation for a lot of Atlas's games. Uh, He's so by the Persona guy. Interesting art style. Yeah, the music is done by Shoji Meg Again, this is made by the, by the Persona team. And it's Katsura Hashino, the director of Persona. Uh, it's it's made by the exact same people, basically. So except it's got Persona nowhere on it. Cool. Actually, it does have some things in common with Persona, like the social uh, link Why stuff. Why does he have ram horns? Because he does. This is a dream, by the way, so it's, it, it doesn't have to make sense. <laughs> Do you die in this playthrough? Just that he has ram horns? Uh, there are parts where I die. Uh, okay, so this is basically... The, uh, okay, the, okay, I know, I know um, Johnny mentioned it in the Brain Scratch one, but I'm going to mention it again. Why is it that when you die, it, it thinks the most important thing is love being over. What about life being over? Oh my <laughs> god, this is like time and eternity. Alright. Except I'm not annoyed yet. So this Where is a tutorial you? stage. Okay. Ah, this music. So eloquent, so dashing, so heroic, so apparently Simply. misfitting. <laughs> but it's misfitting in a good way. And, we, yeah, well, yeah, we can tell he's playing the PS3 version. Well, yeah, the PS3 version is the definitive version of this game. What's wrong with uh, the Xbox version? Uh, there's nothing particularly wrong, it's just that, in, for the sake of fitting the entire... The game is not... The, 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 this game was meant for the PS3 version, and it's 9.5 uh, gigabytes in size. In order to fit it in, in, in an 8.5 uh, gigabyte DVD, which is what the 360 uses, they had to compress the videos. The, the 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 animated movies in a, a bit. I see. I think it was like at some point, like. Not not, not half, to mention. I think not, it was halfway into seven. Sorry, may I? I think it was halfway into seventh gen, like well, when developers started overcoming the problems of the PS3 being so alienware compared to the competition. I think it was at this point where Sony was really stepping up their game with the PS3 and getting exclusive content and getting the best treatment. That also went well hand in hand with the fact that they used Blu-rays as opposed to DVDs. What were you going to say, Pedro? I was going to say that um, the, there's also the fact that the PS3 version has a much better D-pad. The D-pad and the 360 controller fucking sucks. It's so, unusual yeah. to get one of the PlayStation controls. version of a game. And, 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 and I, I, I know, I know what you're going to say. Well, but this, here. this game is played much better with the D-pad rather than the analog stick. So I, so definitely, if you, so definitely, if you can get the PS3 version of this. Hey, Pedro, do you know where I can get a good PlayStation USB controller? Amazon. Uh, the, the PS3 controller doesn't have... A, unlike the 360, there's no USB PS3 controller. All of them are wireless. Uh, that's sort of the problem. Um, no, I, uh, you have a USB um, plug to charge it. Yeah, you can always just uh, keep it plugged uh, all the time if you want. I know, if that's I was hoping for a controller because I use a 360 controller with my computer games, you know. Or the games oh, on that! Steam. I, I, oh, that, I, I get what you're saying. Okay, but back to the actual game. The bells are ringing. Yeah, like I said, Jovi, you can probably find a good one yeah. on that. See how that just connects? <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, the reason he's, he's, resp he's, re he's responding to the tutorial guy saying that these blocks are special. As long as they... As long as... As long as they the, the edges are touching, they won't fall. And Troy Bakers are like, but that doesn't make any sense. What about gravity? Don't think about it. It's a dream. It, it doesn't have to make sense. <laughs> Uh, it's Big Ben. What do you think it is? No, Big Ben sounds completely different. The bell ringing's more big. You know, bong. 
the bell ringing is your war. The bell ringing is your warning that you're uh, almost done climbing. Because again, it wouldn't be a per it wouldn't be a it wouldn't be a Persona team game if you didn't have to climb it something. All right, I got it. Huh. All right, I got it. 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 All right. Another great thing that I love about this game is that it, it, it uh, it's probably the it, it does a fantastic job improving what I, uh, that cell shading graphics can also be used for mature uh, adult games instead of just kids games and like most it can be a lot of stupid oh, people. <laughs> so just asking, does this gameplay thing really go hand in hand with the story, or does it affect the story it, or anything? Uh, it, it does, it does. There's a, there, there's a story reason why this is even happening, don't worry. We'll, we'll get explanation about it soon. In the second part, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. Yay! I got the gold, but lots of heart statue. Mm. Ooh. If, if lots of hearts suddenly shut up a few inches. Well, well, another great thing about Atlas is that uh, they're one of those few developers that do a fantastic job in combining story and gameplay. Just your everyday waking up with bloodshot eyes, where your eyes are really <laughs> red. It's because of the nightmare he was having, which is a supernatural nightmare that is not normal. But uh, we'll eventually see oh, exactly. Space tourism. It seems we have a guy looking to go shooting for the stars. E indeed, and that actually, that actually will factor into one of the eight possible endings. Oh yeah, we're so... gonna get to see all the endings in this commentary eventually, I guess. We are. Sweet. But we're not going to... Uh, I'm going to use YouTube footage to show it because uh, in order to show all eight innings, I would have to play through the, the game eight times. Because oh, this is enough. one of... Because this, unlike, um, uh, because this game takes the other cages concept and does it well, actually. Because every single choice you make in this, in this um, game affects your morality meter and your ending not only... The, will, will, and your ending will depend on where your morality stands. Cool. So are you going to handle this like school days or are you going to handle it where you're actually a faithful guy to... Your love interest. I'm, I, I, I'm going for the be, the purest, yeah. best, good ending because that's the, one, the, the the actual. There's no actual canon ending. You know, the developers didn't actually choose an ending. They're just saying, oh, just pick what ending you prefer. Uh, but uh, usually, the fans lo like to prefer the best, most possibly good ending. So that's the one I'm going with. Yeah, it's like stuff like School Days is All the right, reason uh, why we like to. All right, so uh, plot. Anything extra for this? For what? For all this overtime you're doing. Oh, uh, she likes money. You can also see that this is definitely a Persona team game because the art style is the exact same. Oh my god, Adrian Andrews? She does look like her, doesn't he? Doesn't she? So it's the Adrian Andrews, lot of heart. What's next, Maya Fey? Well, Phoenix, right. <laughs> I'd be surprised if Atlas is like a little tribute to one of the theme songs from Ace Attorney. Where you're in danger? No. Somehow I doubt that. You're being killed or something. No. I usually do the killing in my dreams. <laughs> Suddenly I rethink our relationship. Oh no, attack. Oh boy, wait. Please tell me that we aren't going to be attacked by giant ghost ticks again, are we? Dude, you're supposed to know information like this. <laughs> I'm asking you. It's just my mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. Oh. She's worried about me. <sighs> she knows I've got a career that keeps me busy, but. Yeah. Oh boy, she's gonna be one of it those girlfriends, isn't now. she? <laughs> the ones that only cares about money. Sometimes easy's best. How charming. And who knows what'll happen in the future? Oh. Really? Hello. I suppose. What? What is it? Oh, I could possibly be a little bit ahead of you. I just saw a dead-looking thing. <laughs> ah, yeah, there we are. Uh, yeah, Jesus Christ. Oh my god, it is becoming Ace Attorney. We've got someone murdered and everything. Go to 14 minutes and, uh... No, 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 since I'm ahead of you, what I'll do, I'll just pause for a couple of seconds and then play again. Sure. And yes, sudden deaths. Oh, this really is a uh, Persona-designed this game. <laughs> Wait, there's... Okay, I have no. Okay, I should probably let the audience know I have never played a Persona game, and I have no well, idea what Persona in, is about. I, I can only speak for Persona 4, but how people died in that game was they um, they turn up dead in all sorts of weird ways. Like one gets impaled on the um, 
on the yeah. telephone pole. So. Sounds like Higurashi. And, uh, and, and there's a similar thing in this Ooh, game, too. No. Mm. Higurashi mm. is more inflicted is pain. Wrestling? This sounds <laughs> like... Um, this persona sounds more like... Um, sounds oh, what's me. that movie? She finally wants you to tie the knot. This is... Die so, yeah, you, so, yeah, you can clearly... So, yeah, you can clearly tell... Like, Final Destination. Ah, and that's it. it so yeah, you can clear. So yeah, you can clearly tell this is who, who made this game. Can't you, Dwebs? <laughs> yes. All right. Truly the I most healthiest that. of lifestyles, <laughs> smoking around everywhere, basically, and drinking beer. Basically, basically, Dwebs, in a similar way to the social links in Persona, uh, this this game is also going to be a thing where we're, we're in a bar, we can talk to people, and uh, basically we can help them with their problems and stuff. We can by talking right, to them. And the more we talk to them and the more we reassure them, the the better, the, like, uh, the, the more they'll stay alive. Are we uh, going to be any characters called Johnny and Mark? Uh, no. Sorry. Ah, no room you references. Saying, huh? You were saying? Oh, shit, what was I talking about? I... You were talking about how much you About the lifestyle, them. I think. Happening. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I have to say, um, I'm guessing this is an atlas thing to have people constantly smoking and possibly doing some of the most unhealthiest things? Uh, not... Well, this is... This, well, this, unlike Persona, this movie, this story is, a, is all adults. All the characters are adults. It's not school. Whereas uh, Persona, they're like 15 to 16. So it's... Uh, Huh. Oh shit! Uh, so yeah, that was Paul, that was Paul, the guy we saw dead. He died mysteriously uh, during the night. I hate the news too. And I don't know, maybe. What did he? What did he fap himself to death or something? Well, don't worry, we'll get girlfriend Adrian Andrews did mention that she seems to kill men in her dreams. <laughs> She's the main villain. Oh, um, wow. <laughs> That's a problem. Yeah, great. Cream the rabbit is a dream killer. Wow, you pissed the bed for the first time since grade school. <laughs> I had a really scary dream. Scary, dude. It was just a platforming dream. I'd love to have a dream. Yeah, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Yeah, but I think that's your favorite. Uh, uh, yeah, 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 Jova. But once we learn what happens to to any character in this game that doesn't manage to survive those puzzles, you wouldn't say that anymore. Dang it! If only if he'd had nights. I once had him. a dream where I was in a Skyrim environment fighting people from Team Fortress. I once oh had a dream where I actually went That was fun. <laughs> yeah. I actually had a dream where I went to Nightopia and got to fight alongside knights against wise men. Oh, awesome. That has got to be one of the best dreams ever, considering how knights actually plays. Yeah, I, I, I got to agree with what that guy said, Justin. I've seen the playthroughs of this game. What does she see in that guy, aside from money? Uh, well, actually, Erica, th there is one point where Erica actually does give a good reason. It's because uh, uh, Vincent tickles her maternal instincts. As, as, uh, an independent, strong female is attracted to uh, guys who just, you know, don't don't know how to run their own life and stuff like that. The, uh, that's what that's the excuse the game gives, of course. But uh, I'm no psychologist, so I can't really say anything more. <laughs> All right. So basically, uh, I can reply to some messages. Uh, all this right. has been a smashing commentary so far. Let's see. So at this point, we've established that Lot of Heart is apparently someone watching over this entire story. Yes, Jova, we get it. Across, yes, Jova, okay. we get it. Your love is attorney. And also... Uh, Ace attorney versus uh, Sonic the okay, Hedgehog. She right, we get she it. Right, she <laughs> right, read it. Oh? It's Catherine. Okay. Like I said before, I'm having dinner with some old friends. It's surprising. Most of them are already married, and almost half of them have kids. They're all showing off pictures of their families, and it makes me feel left out. Maybe it's time for us to get out our comfort zone, too. So, um, Catherine's gone from sounding like an American to sounding like a Welshman. Yep. Now, you see, I don't like girls like this. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Well, like ones? Like no, no, because there are actually girls out there who are like, "Oh, my friends are pregnant. I want to have a baby too." Really? Like, yeah, there are there are legitimately, unfortunately, girls out there who do have this mindset. That's why I said. That, that's why I said earlier. <laughs> this, she's gonna be one of those girlfriends. <laughs> uh, 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 which is why I originally was thinking of. Uh, 
picking the other Catherine, but uh, and for but but for the sake of you know picking the one that people usually consider the true ending, even though it's not actually there's no true ending. I guess I'll court. I'll guess I guess I'll be nice to Catherine. You know, Pedro. Okay. I think the reason people like that ending, it, it might be going on a limb here. It's because of school days. Now, true. pardon me if I go in a mini ramp, but hold for on, those who hold don't on, know, hold on, hold on, let. Uh, he all on that thought because we have to read this. What's can going on about? here? I'm, I'm replying to her uh, message, basically. Basically, I can pick between various options for each sentence. All right, so so, so I'm trying to be nice to her. Send this message. I, I'm, I'm I guess she's a bit. Yeah, I bet her reply is going to be yeah. less did you, than... Did you, notice that you, did you notice that meter that appeared at, um, yeah. at the yeah. bottom right corner? Well, that's, the, that's this game's affection meter. Basically, every, oh, well, I'll just let the game explain it. So let me guess, red's evil, blue is good. Of course. Uh, I prefer when red's well, the good one. more calm and angry than good and evil. Uh, Indeed. Anyway. So yeah, basically every single thing, every response I give to messages, every choice I have will affect the the meter and uh, it, it, it oh. my morality. My mora my endings will depend on where I stand about the two girls. Yeah. Wow, this this Spam. makes it all seem the more like it's an answer to school days. Oh yeah. All right. Congratulations, you have ah. You have completed stage one, basically. That's what they're saying. Oh. oh. Okay. If you want cool. to, if you want to reach I, press the reach I button. You'll be put in a coma instantly. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> I can also use my phone to save data, so let's let's do that. Hey, hey, what's the main character? Hey, Vincent, come on, guys, I'm just saving my game on my phone. Uh, why would you do that? Because Atlas said so. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> oh, where was I talking about? Oh yeah, I was talking about. School. You don't understand. I have to get the bird through the pipes. <laughs> <laughs> you sewer pipes. Whatever happened to so the just Teenage getting Mutant the Ninja Turtle? The good old great no. vines. All right, so this is the loading screen. Usually, the loading screen is always this. Uh, I guess it's supposed Guys, to. Help. What's the time? I can't tell. It's at eighty. No, it's at twelve. <laughs> it's free. Ah. Oh, and by the way, the bar is called the stray sheep. <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Stray sheep. This this game is starting to sound even more Welsh. No, no, no there, there's a, there's a there, there's a good reason why the the sheep. There's a good reason. The, the, the sheep. The, the, there's people around Shearwater's area that can only think about being pregnant. Ooh, the whole sheep symbolism. Uh, oh the no, whole, no no no! Not in my area. The whole I sheep mean, thing. Not, the, the whole sheep thing is symbolism. So, but we'll see eventually. I just know that there are definitely people out there who have this mindset, like anywhere in the world. Oh my God! <laughs> it's that guy from the Titanic film. Oh my God! He does look like him. Oh, hi, Laura Bailey. Wait, which Titanic Bro. film? Wow, this is this, this. There's a lot of franchises like thrown Wait, in here. What? Where's this? Where did she come from? Uh, <clears throat> I'm guessing she entered through the door. Yeah, but she just popped up out of nowhere. Well, but we're gonna see. Ex we're, we're gonna see exactly what what what, what was their meeting like. But uh, for now, um, we're gonna see it later in the flashback. For now, we'll we'll skip back to the next nightmare. I, uh... Uh, no, I don't have any wool. Get, re <laughs> get, you, get, get, get used to this, Jovo. Atlas is weird. <laughs> ba, ba, black, she ba, ba, black sheep, have you any wool? No, get the fuck out of here! Of course I don't have any wool. I'm down to my boxers here. <laughs> oh. Alright, so stage two. Prison of despair. Again? The yes. I was at the bar and this girl came in and then... Are all the remember. dream stages like this? With the tower? Uh, yeah, that's what jump, this is. Uh, the, jump, that's what, jump quickly. That's what this game is. It's a Qbert inspired uh, puzzle game. Did I, just, I see. Did I, did I, did I just call that's him Joel? Yes, you did. All right. Okay, yeah, I, okay, I know his name's Vincent, but Joel's a much easier name to remember, so let's just call him Joel. This is now a uh, Last of Us sequel, where Joel moved <laughs> to Japan, got a new haircut, shaved well, you might, his you, beard. If you're gonna call him by a... Uh, okay, any... so that's about four franchises now. 
All right, <laughs> let's try to somehow pay attention to how the game works. Uh, There's going to be obstacles, right. aren't there? Yes. When you can, you can hang from blocks, and you can use them as it's a really useful technique for when there's no way to get forward, like right now. So, Joel, he thought zombies were a pain in the ass. Now he has to contend with his own dreams. Oh yeah. We're getting deep now. You know, I bet this is all of this is the reason why Joel eventually decided. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to be the actual contender antagonist for once. And thus, he became Simon Blackwell, so he could actually not have to deal with all the stuff that a player protagonist has to deal with. And then he turned into that guy from Infamous Second Son. The the, the game starts off uh, easy, you know, it's it's still in the tutorial stages, and it gets but, hard. Tr but trust me, like any Atlas game, this game will kick you, it will kick your ass because you know Atlas is never afraid to challenge the players. I mean, I mean yes, it's something that involves quick reaction or requires it. You, yeah, yeah, you have to be quick, more like quick thinking. Alright, so we can push multiple blocks at the same time, so... Uh, we have to keep this in mind for later puzzles. Okay. My Professor Layton senses are tingling. Edge. We're yeah, climbing the tower. That's pretty much what the... the that's pre the, 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 I mean, of course the execution is completely different than Professor Layton, but yeah, the, you can, uh, I, you can, I can, I can, I, I'm guessing, I'm guessing the Persona team played Professor Layton, and they're like, hmm, a story-driven puzzle game, we can do that too. And Come on, voila. let's make one. Not only did they do well, that, they also like got a pretty him, good game. Yep, and they got him platforming as well. Not bad. No, 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 there's, there's no platforming, there's no platforming, you can, you, those jumps that you're seeing, Joe, but they're, they're not, they're scripted jumps. When I, when I, when I, pr when I press towards a block, he automatically jumps towards that block, as long so as... The, so okay. the currency, so the currency in this game is wow, pillow it fluff. Wow, thing right now. <laughs> no, 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 the pillows grant me additional continues. Yeah. The money I mean, is... I mean, I mean, the currency is pillow fluff. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, it does look like that. <laughs> Basically, Jova, the way this works is it's all about, you know, climbing and making a path for yourself using the various blocks, and it oh, gets yeah. more and more complicated oh, yeah, as it goes on. Oh, yeah. By the way, does, um, <clears throat> does how quickly you finish these levels um, affect the story as well? No, 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 no. Uh, um, there's, there's one thing I've just remembered. Um, in the Persona 4 anime, one of the ringtones... Oh, uh, okay, hold on. We're going to get, we're gonna get some uh, plot explanation for the dreams right now. Oh. It'll, it'll be quick, I promise. Okay. One of the things, one of the mobile phone things that the main character gets is one of, is a piece of music from this game. Yeah, I've heard that too. Yeah. Yeah. Basically, Jova. If you basically Jova, the men uh, of this town are having this dream. Uh, all, 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 every day, and if they die in these uh, dreams, they die in real life, and that's why that guy we saw earlier was like dead. And that's basically what happens if you die in, in if you don't complete. The Ooh. You die if you're killed. I see. And so then we, every and then... single man in this town is having the same dream every day. We'll eventually get an explanation as to why these dreams are even happening, but they wouldn't guess, be. To everyone else, they look like sheep, except for the person who is in the dream. Yeah, to yeah, is it yeah. because of the women? Because you said like this is about women like treating men yeah. like. Crap. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. Actually, we'll get we'll get an explan we'll get an explanation for that in the next part. But for okay. now, I can say uh, that yes, Joba, you guessed it. Uh, everybody <sighs> see each other as cheap as sheep. Vincent is seeing everybody as sheep except for him. Oh. <clears throat> Do I look like I'm joking? <laughs> now let's get the hell out of here. It's much easier said than on the uh, Shiroi. Oh. Which is <laughs> yes, go talk Man, to the sheep. Where's the knights them. when you need them? Yes, go talk to the sheep. You'll understand them clearly. Bah, bah, bah. <laughs> because, because and, and here's one thing. Uh, here's where the mor here's where the morality gets gray. The, uh, there's going to be points where we we find w w some of these sheep during our puzzle sections, and the, sometimes we have to purposely push them out of the way and kill them in order to survive ourselves. Ooh. Ooh. Let me guess. Are they trying to push you off too? Yep. It's okay. it, 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 it's survival of the fittest. Is there ever a way to ever awesome. you know clear an entire level without pushing them off? 
there if you're willing to you know but uh, usually i usually it's uh, if you want to survive especially if you want to get a gold trophy you better just you know do it the quickest so way this is basically so out of my way so does pushing them off like affect anything like score wise or gameplay or story yeah, wise yeah 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 you can, can get a higher score if you do things quickly so maybe Pushing oh, down the okay. sheep. I mean, does killing these people affect your morality? Because you said there's a morality. No, the, no, the, the 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 puzzles themselves don't affect the morale. The morality is only affected by dialogue choices and. Uh, okay. <laughs> all right. Uh, that so that was. <laughs> so we're still recording. So hold on. Uh, that was Catherine. Uh, I hope part one. Join us for the next part. See you then. Yeah.